Oh my gosh, guys, look at this package. Look at just came via Logan's car. You guys ready? Can you handle this? Can you handle this? Let's just take this off. And let's throw this on. Bam! What do you guys think? Is that Nar Nar? I gotta look at myself in the mirror. I haven't even seen myself in it. Hi, Logan. Oh, snap. Oh, snap a dap. Oh, I likey. Casey, likey. You guys wanna see the other ones? We just dropped these today, right, Log? Yep. They're on the Trixon website. Go to Trixon.com and get your own hat. Here's the lineup. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, Look at that. Those Boom. are the old ones. Check it. I think this is my favorite one. You like the green letters? I don't know. I think I like the black letters. You think so? I know you guys. Which one do you Which like? Which ones do you guys like? I like this one a lot too. I love that color. Really? I know already Gage is gonna steal this hat from me. Which ones do you guys like? We got the gray, red, blue, which will be Gage's, camo with the black Trixon, and the uh, green triangle, or the green writing with the black triangle. I'm gonna rock this one today, guys. Damn. I gotta bend it a little bit. I'm not a true flatty guy. You did good, Logue. Did you design all these? Did them all by myself. Dude, you're nar nar. Boom, boom. Yeah, so they're gonna sell fast. How many did we do? We only did, there's only 50 available of each color. Really? Except for the camos. There's 125 camos each. 125 so camos. You better, you better go get So there's 50. This released color. this morning, so um, by the time I get this up tonight, hopefully they're not sold out. They won't be. I don't think. Maybe they will be. We're releasing a color today. We've released the camo and the red ones. So, stay so the other colors are coming? Yeah, but you can show them. Okay, well I can show you guys, but they won't. Uh, the gray we let release today? Okay, we released the red one today, so go buy that one if you uh, want it. The other, the blue and the white one will release tomorrow, and the camel ones drop today. They're rad, guys. The reason I love these hats the most is because they're comfortable. Are you playing with Bronxy? Are you playing with Bronxy? <laughs> You're so cute. You wanna vlog? Say hello. <laughs> you can't eat it. You can't eat it. I can never catch it on film when he plays with Bronx. Like every time he starts doing it, I take the camera out and sneak it out and try to get him. And then I'll look up and be like, oh, you're recording? Oh, I wanna come say hi. Did you say hi? Say hi, guys. Well, there you go. Imagine that. Guess what we're doing for the 18th time in the last week and a half. <laughs> Cheerleading performance. Yay! Are you so holla holla? Yeah. What did Where I tell you guys about that hat? You like that hat? Mm -hmm. Look at dad's. I told you he was going to steal it from me. First thing he did when I got home with those hats, I'm having this one, dad. It's my hat, dad. Huh. Let's go watch some more cheerleading, guys. Yay! Someone's excited about the cheerleading. Woo! That's hilarious. Uh oh, here it goes, here it goes, going down. I'm gonna try to record Braley this time, not some random girl. Alright guys, help me find her, help me find her. Where's she at? Where's she at? There she at. Right there, right there. There she's at. Go, Bray Bray! Oh, imagine that, huh? Right next to Avia. They had to talk about their back handspring. Did you nail it, Avia? I nailed it. Did you nail it? She did it. She did a good job. It was better than the last time. The better than the worm she did. Let's see it. Let's see it. Oh, the lawnmower. The lawnmower. 
Good job, sweetie. You nailed your back handsprings. Yeah. That's right? Do you feel comfortable doing them? Um, no. Why? I don't they know. looked awesome. You guys did great. Good work. High five. Elbows. Elbows. Boom. Honey, what did you think about Braley's performance? Oh, she did such a good job. What? You did? I thought she did awesome too, huh? How are you doing? <laughs> Look at these two cuties just hanging out, being BFFs. <laughs> I don't think they really know how to act around each other. He's Mr. Excited. Huh? Okay. Are you excited? For you? Strawberry lemonade. You Strawberry excited? Lemonade? Huh? <laughs> yeah. For you, sir. Uh, Diet Coke. I think he was like, that's a little close case. My dad doesn't put it that close to me. You want this? Here. You can eat it. Watch Winston. Winston. Here. Yay! Eat it. Eat it. Oh, okay. Okay, so I have a he used to like it. He used to like them. He's eaten full lemons before. Not full lemons, but like... Yeah, he changes every day. He used to eat these. What a beautiful, glorious day we had. Fun, fun-filled day with the family. In yesterday's video, I answered a couple questions that had been asked on my last Hush video, and I told you guys yesterday, ask some more questions, I'll answer a few more. Okay, this question is from Thirk Ninhas. That's... A German name, I think. No, Norwegian. Is that Norwegian? Has dots. I don't know. I'm so uncultured. The question is, though, what do you get more excited of hunting with a gun or a bow? Both are super fun, but I get more excited about hunting with my bow. That's kind of where my passion really started was archery elk hunting when I was a kid with my dad. I loved it, and I still do today. And so, like, I love rifle hunting, and there's different challenges that come with each, but if I was to pick or choose, I would say a bow. Plus a bow is funner to just go out and shoot recreationally. Like, I can't go sit behind my rifle and shoot it for hours, but I can go and shoot my bow for hours. All right, this question is from Liz X. It says, Casey, please say hi, Liz. Hey, Liz. It would make my day. I'm glad I just made your day. Liz, it's all about you, isn't it? I'm just kidding. But is it? Is it all about you, Liz? Also, what is your favorite animal to hunt and what is your favorite animal to eat? Also, very good question. I like hunting all Western big game animals, elk, deer, antelope, but I think my very favorite would have to be elk. I love hunting elk. What is my favorite animal to eat? Hands down by far right now, and it changes every once in a while, but for the last few years, it's been antelope. A lot of hunters would disagree and be like, antelope tastes like crap. If you take care of the animal right after you kill it, antelope, to me, and I know a lot of other people agree, is by far the very best. It's, my family enjoys it more than anything. A close second for me though, and this might surprise you, bear meat. Bear meat is delicious. If you cook it right, it can be almost as good as antelope. All right, I had to switch over my phone because my camera died, but I'm gonna answer one more question. And it is from Jeff. Guys, what's up with these names? Taichin? Taichin. Sorry, Jeff, I'm just, I'm really just starting to learn how to read. Why did you start the Hush channel? Great question, Jeff. Um, I don't know the ultimate answer to that. I had always wanted to have a hunting show. And back then, when this dream was born, the only thing around was TV. And so I always wanted to have a TV show. And so when me and Kaylee were married, like first married, like maybe two years into it, I started really researching on how to get a TV show. Well, I discovered that to have a hunting show on TV, you either had to have a bunch of money, you had to have a bunch of sponsors behind you, or you had to be willing to throw down a bunch of money you didn't have. Well, those three things just didn't make sense to me, so I was like, well, that's never gonna happen. It was kind of like this dream that I pushed away, and I was like, Psh, I'm not rich. I don't have a bunch of sponsors behind me. I don't know how to get a bunch of sponsors behind me, and I wasn't willing to throw out $150,000 or whatever it is to have a hunting show, which is really close to $150,000, sometimes even more. So when Shay was trying to convince me and Kaylee to do YouTube, I was kind of like, nah, I don't want to do that. I've never been that guy in front of the camera or wanted to be. But what if you could do a hunting channel one day on YouTube? And I thought, well, that would be great. That's like my dream. But at the same time, like, that's kind of not the community that's on YouTube, I don't think. And Shay's like, eventually it will be. And you could change a lot of people's minds. And so that's really when I started thinking, I would love to share 
my passions for the outdoors with hunters, A, and B, I would like to share it with people that don't hunt. And I knew I was gonna have a lot of critics, but at the same time, now the further I get into it, I realized having hunters watch my videos and think they're cool is awesome, I love that. But having non-hunters watch my video and think it's cool is the coolest thing in the world, in my opinion. So why did I start the Hush channel? I started it because I always wanted to share my passions with people. The reason I still do it, I love bringing new people into the sport and showcasing what hunting really is about. Even if they never hunt, a lot of people have told me that they understand hunting now, which they didn't before my channel. So I think that's pretty cool. Anyways, guys, thanks for the questions. Great questions. That was fun. I want to do that more. Maybe we'll do that more. Tell me if you guys like me doing this or not, or if it, you guys think I'm a real stupid head. Do you guys think I'm a stupid head? <laughs> I try not to be a stupid head.